and today I'm going to show you how to play a maths card game called War. I'm going to show you how you can use this game to practice addition, multiplication, greater than, less than and for comparing fractions. In our first game I'm going to show you how to practice addition. You need a pack of cards from ace to ten. Ace is worth one. Once you have shuffled your pile of cards, split it into two and place both piles down on the table. Both players turn over a card. The first player to add the two numbers together and call out the answer wins both cards. Here I've turned over eight and nine, so if I call out 17 first, I get to keep both cards. Keep on playing until all the cards have gone. The winner is the player with the most cards at the end of the game. In the next game, I'm going to show you how to practice multiplication. As last time, the cards are split into two piles. Both players turn over two cards and the first person to multiply the numbers from both cards together and call out the answer wins the two cards. Here I have turned over a 9 and a 7. If I call out 63 first I get to keep both cards. Again, keep on playing until all the cards have gone and the winner is the player with the most cards at the end. This time we're going to practice greater than and less than. Both players turn over a card. The person who puts their hand on the card which is greater than the other card gets to keep both cards. So here, if I put my hand on the 10 first, I get to keep both cards. Another version of this game would be to put my hand on the card which is less than the other card. So here, I would put my hand on the 6. The final game I'm going to show you is comparing fractions. Both players turn over two cards and put the higher number beneath the lower number to make a fraction. The winner is the first person to put their hand on the pair of cards which is the highest fraction. Here I've made three fifths and the other player has made one third. I know that three fifths is more than a half and one third is less than a half. So three fifths must be the bigger fraction. Why don't you try these games and try making up some of your own? I hope you found that useful. If you did, please like my video and subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading a video with something new every week. See you soon. Bye!